operation based in Newport is embarking on a very important mission under the sea. ABC6 reporter Julie Radiski went to the New Jersey shore to get a sneak peek. The Atlantic Surveyor is no ordinary boat. It's designed to solve underwater mysteries using science to see down below. We're here conducting hydrographic research to update the nautical charts for NOAA. Our camera went along to watch how it's done. Revealing what lies on the bottom of the ocean takes work. We're using a variety of different instruments to do that. We're using a multi-beam sonar to take soundings of the bottom. And we're also using a towed side scan system to look horizontally across the bottom for items. Once the side scan sonar is placed in the water, crews on the deck are busy analyzing all that information. This is the actual data that's coming across right now. SAIC's animation merges sonar data with surface maps and photos from the scene to give the government a clear picture of the sea bottom. Uh -huh. You're looking um, at a football field wide, really. Sometimes they discover a piece of history. This is actually a wreck. We get a better idea of what it looks like. Other times, dangerous objects appear. These three dots are actually large poles that could pose a danger to passing ships. They use it to navigate the oceans and they need to know where obstructions are and how deep it is so that they don't run aground. That kind of information could prevent disasters like the Buzzards Bay oil spill or be used to map underwater damage caused by hurricanes. In fact, the technology was used last year to help guide supply ships into New Orleans following Hurricane Katrina. And who knows what else this device could reveal about the mysteries under the sea. In New Jersey, Julie Ruditsky, ABC 6 News.